Go ahead. Okay, so this is day two of the chatter project. We have this piece still attached to the bath. We could take it off to trim the foot, but we're not ready for that yet. We have to do some chattering to it. And I'm going to show you a few solutions here. We can use a wire loop tool to do chattering. And we could also use a credit card or some kind of stiff ID that you can find in your wallet. So um, whatever tool you choose, make sure it's clean. Okay, and this is anchored to the bat. I haven't tried to take it off yet, so we can turn it on. And chattering works best when it's going fast. So chatter is a technique that is similar to trimming, but it's going to start vibrating and making noise when we when we do it. I hold the end of the tool here, and you can see little pieces coming off. It's getting louder. The louder it gets, the more chatter effect we get. stops getting louder, then the chatter effect is over. So you should stop. Okay, I think we'll, I'm going to stop there and just stop it and show you what it did. So it created some just random uh, diagonal lines because this tool is diagonal. If we use a straight tool, We'll get a different result here. So I'll, I'll use this one down here. So I'm holding the tool loosely. I'm letting it vibrate. If I hold it strong, it's not going to vibrate. It's called chatter because it makes that noise. Notice the angle I'm holding it to the to get the effect. Okay, can you see that? Okay, so this is this is an example of the vertical line. So now um, I'm just going to pull this card out of here. And we're going to try this on it. And this, you have to kind of curve it back, I found. And But the effect is very good. Okay, so there you can see the effect of the card there. So if I just hold the card like this, that's doing nothing. It's just polishing. So we have to we have to bend it back this way. good result here. Okay, so you just never know what you're going to get, but the effect is usually pretty cool. So that's called chatter. Any questions? No. No questions from Elise. I'd like to uh, have a shout out to Elise to thank, thank her for helping me videotape this. Um, can you go a little wide angle here now? Yeah. Just to remind people how to get this off of here. So this is actually ready to trim the foot. So if we bend it, you can see it kind of cracking near the base, separating from the back. And then we just turn it sideways, give it a tap, a little twist, and it comes off neatly and we can trim the foot of this today. All right, excellent.